The South Korean Army decommissioned five decades old UH 1H helicopters with indigenous multi role Shurian rotorcraft ready to take the place. The Army had 129 Bell UH 1H helicopters in service. They flew an accumulated 792,000 hours over 146 million kilometers during the period. An upgraded version of the Shurian could also be deployed soon. These aircraft will be used to transport emergency patients. The KUH-1 Shurian was developed by Korea Aerospace Industries Kai, and Eurocopter. They will be used in a variety of applications, including troop assault, search and rescue, tactical lift, liaison and medical evacuation. It can accommodate a pilot, co-pilot, two gunners and nine troops. The helicopter features an inertial navigation system, global positioning system, an automatic flight control system, forward-looking infrared radar and a digital map. Shurian is also equipped with a health and usage monitoring system, a modular weapon system, a countermeasure dispensing system, infrared countermeasures, electronic countermeasures, a radar warning receiver, a hands-on collective and stick, and an onboard inert gas generating system. The helicopter is fitted with six BGM-71 tube-launched optically tracked tow air-to-air -to -air missiles or four rocket pods. The BGM-71 TOW is an anti-tank guided missile designed and developed by Hughes Aircraft. The maximum operational range of the missile is 3,750 meters. It weighs around 3.9 kilograms to 5.9 kilograms.